Okay, guys. Uh, so I wanna make a video. I'm trying to speak in English in this video. So I'm coming to. I'm interesting to somehow. I'm I'm working in the project. Actually, I'm a civil engineer background education, and then I'm working in the project. Uh, building a refinery and then this is the first time I was exposed to the process industry uh, it's with oil palm oil refinery and then I was sometimes curious and then and the is this a good path career or not and then I was was interesting I saw the organization of the uh, on the on the plan and then this operator technician and then supervisor and then manager and then I was asking sometimes to my friends the supervisors and then so if you want to be up your career or upgrade your career you need to kick your manager or the manager need to be left and then you get a position All right and then somehow the operator and then I'm thinking the operator or the let's say the technician the operator Meanwhile, they are a bachelor degree, some of them, and then so they will be educated by the supervisor, the experience, and then well, if they want to get to be opportunity to be a supervisor, of course, after there's one supervisor get left, and then otherwise they will find another company, so, and supervisor need to educate more people again, so, because unless he will stay for a long time and then he will be get a senior or something like that and then this is the challenging that uh, the company facing in, uh, about the human resources but what I saw in this company they they make it, it interesting that they make uh, the people keep on challenging they give the, them some of the training they give them uh, new uh, tools the uh, high end tools and then they were promising and then uh, that they will uh, send these guys and then uh, one day to the another uh, business unit I mean to educate or when the company built the other refinery they will be the the what you call it uh, the expert for the uh, new plan but I'm thinking and then uh, in my role in the construction and then it's also it's more variable. I mean, it's more variable. It's the position. There's so many things. Before I'm thinking during my college, I was thinking everybody will be a civil engineer, a site engineer, and then. But there's so many. I mean, there's consultant, and then in the project itself, it grew up. When you're facing mega project, there's a cost engineer, and then there's a project control, there's a supervisor, there's a QC, so many and then site manager construction and project manager but now i'm also uh, feel the same what i'm thinking on the like in the plan itself i mean the operation once you get let's say 15 years or 10 years uh, experience since and then you're starting applying a more job another job and then because you are a contract or not permanent finish one project and then you need to find another project another company that have a good project and then a good salary and then it might be come to two things I mean whether you apply for the next level position or you keep on the position and then with the, the expecting higher salary there is one word that uh, disturbing this me, me my mind uh, a few days is about offer price yeah so uh, it's not like buying a land I mean nowadays I think so the it's like uh, when you buy a land in 1995 and then the price will be grow up, grow up linearly during the year, and now it's maybe every year it will be rise, rise. But uh, the company right now is like 
thinking okay you 15 years salary and but we don't need 15 years salary we need five years salary is enough for us it's like we don't need 35 years 35 years old supervisor we just need like uh, five years like 25 20 uh, 30 years old 